Alright, what's up you guys? It is your girl Mia Morell and I am back with another video. So today we are at the um institution, whatever the fuck. Detroit Arts. Y'all see this? Y'all see this right here. Put the camera up there. Okay, because y'all know I'll be having problems with my pronunciation. So getting serious um a lot of people have been like basically asking me like what to do in a time like this you know like what's going on a lot of people are lost don't nobody know like you know how to navigate through this time so i'm basically about to give y'all my advice you know the instructions on how to basically raise your vibration and just keep doing what you do and block out everything else that's going on so um i just want to start by saying first of all as y'all all know that i talked about my other videos we are ascending you feel me when i say ascending i don't mean literally like how can i say it? like physically like you're gonna physically see it but no it's an ascension in consciousness you know what i'm saying the shift has already started so basically to get on that wave you got to start going within start doing daily meditations you know what I'm saying? When you're focusing on your breath and stuff like that, start paying attention to your thoughts and everything like that. And that, that'll help you, first of all, get grounded. You know what I'm saying? So after you do that, I would advise you to start, you know, eating right. Because that helps raise your vibration when you are eating right. See, when we eating meats and shit like that, we're not able to, you know what I'm saying, operate our, at our fullest potential. You know what I'm saying? So... With that being said, I'm not trying to get too off a uh, task or whatever. But, yeah, basically, you navigate through this time by basically, you know, listening to your intuition, uh, heightening your vibration, everything like that. Now, if you're one of those people that, you know, is basically waiting on that Savior and stuff like that, I'm here to tell you that the Savior is within you. You are your own Savior. You know what I'm saying? Because a lot of people, they waiting for somebody to come up out the sky and be like, okay, you go on me, you go on me, whatever. No, that's not what's about to go down. You feel me? It's not the end of the world. It's basically the beginning of a new world, a new way of thinking, a new way of doing things. Basically ascended to a place where fear and hate don't exist. So, honestly, I would say... Get yourself out of that low vibration. Get out of the state of fear. You know what I'm saying? Regardless of who win the election and stuff like that, they both pushing the same agenda. You know what I'm saying? The new world order, whatever, you know, how you want to put it. So basically, only how we get through this is if we go within, focus on ourselves, and basically create our own world you have to understand that you are able to create your own reality you don't have to go with the things that you see on a day-to-day -day basis you know what i'm saying and when i explain this it's like it's not that easy to just go with because you got people around you that you know what i'm saying look at life in a different way but you can't let that basically deter your path you know what i'm saying so yeah that's basically my my opinion on what you should do in times like this start creating your own reality ask yourself what is it that you want and stuff like that and just keep going your way you know what i'm saying start and another thing like start being optimistic and you can start being optimistic by taking time off of social media you know what i'm saying because on social media you got motherfuckers going back to back everybody at each other next you know what i'm saying it's even relationships you know tearing apart because of who people voted for and shit like that no take your time off of social media you feel me and look at all of this like okay don't nobody know what's gonna happen but i know it's gonna be a positive outcome you know what i'm saying and just basically stay on your spiritual journey don't let none of this like fuck you up okay this sun is in my eye it's beaming real bad so if i'm screaming too much don't mind that and then, okay, so let me take another time. Another thing I wanted to say. Basically, okay, this is my opinion on a new world order, okay? Because a lot of people got their own different opinion and shit like that. I feel like basically it's a, a new way of control. 
You know what I'm saying? Because you got people like me stepping out. You got like a lot of other people making YouTube channels and stuff in that nature. I feel like basically they pushing in this new thing so that we can be controlled. We won't able to be, you know, freely thinking like this. We won't able to be, you know, expressing ourselves and stuff like that. So um, I would strongly advise you guys to you know, pay attention to these people, regardless of how many subscribers they got, regardless of how many likes and views they got. Stop looking at that. Look at what the person is talking about. Look at the topic, because there's going to come a time, because like I said, basically, they pushing in control. You know what I'm saying? They want control of humanity. You feel me? They, they don't want no free thinking. So, I would basically say, like, go on YouTube, you know what I'm saying? Find those videos of Type in the topic that you want to learn about. You know what I'm saying? Because uh, it's, it's a video out there for damn near everything. You feel me? Type in, you know, the great awakening, spiritual awakening, stuff like that. Start to gain your knowledge and then go within so you can just put the pieces together. You know what I'm saying? <clears throat> because, like I said, there was I was starting to say, there's going to come a time where you're not going to be able to connect to people how you used to. You know what I'm saying? Because... This spiritual movement, like a lot of other people are waking up, so they can easily, you know what I'm saying, block out, okay, whoever talking about spirituality, blah, blah, stuff like this, they can easily block all of that out, you know what I'm saying, you won't be able to search that up, so it's important right now, while you have the chance to gain your knowledge, you know what I'm saying, get smart, get educated, and also go within and get your own, you feel me, understanding. Because can't nobody just break it down in a one, two, three step. Like, no. It's it's a lot, you feel me, going on the spiritual journey and stuff like that. So you have to learn from other people, but it's also you have to come into an understanding within yourself. So um, before I wrap it up, I want to just say make sure y'all are eating right, meditating, getting out in nature. You know what I'm saying? And just being optimistic about the future. Don't let none of this mess you up on your path anything that you truly want to do in your heart express it let it out you know what i'm saying be yourself live your best life and do you okay and make sure you get in nature go touch trees hug a tree bitch hug a tree hug a tree bitch i did what i had to do said what i had to motherfucking say memorial signing out oh my god